Maddie G, I work at a university. They pay for two free classes uh, per semester. I want to learn coding, but calculus is required, and I'm terrible at math. You have to uh, challenge. Uh, you have to challenge yourself. You have to challenge yourself. And Maddie G, look, I had a problem with calculus when I first took it at university. Okay, I failed it the first time I took it because I assumed I could just coast through it. <laughs> I didn't coast through it. I thought I could cram for it. So like the night before the final, the next morning, I went to university and grabbed, cracked open the book and tried to learn the whole semester in overnight. And that's what I used to do. I used to, I, li I like doing hardcore overnight sessions, man. That's an amazing space to be in as a student. When you sit there all night, pull all nighters learning something like you just immerse yourself in that topic, right? It, I, I don't know if you guys have done it. If you've gone to university, most likely you have done it. I I thrived on that. I thrived on it. It is brilliant, right? Uh, but I couldn't do it for calculus. And I retook it again um, when I transferred universities. And it, again, I didn't really fully understand it. One of the reasons I had pretty crappy uh, profs. But I read the book and all of a sudden it just clicked for me, right? And once you understand calculus, it just is. It's, it's the introduction of time into mathematics, introduction of the rate of change into mathematics. So what it is, it's just basically, it, and that's the key to understanding calculus, right? Understand what it is, not how to do calculus, but why you're doing it and what it is, right? So calculus is basically looking at functions, not in a static form, right? not a static moment, but looking at functions and how they change and trying to understand the rate of change of that function, of that system, right? Doing the calculus, looking into the future, right? And extrapolating data from the past. That's the first step in calculus. And once you grasp that, then you go into it with the right perspective, I think. Right? That's what made it click for me.